Good morning, Montenegro. Ah. I couldn't imagine any better place in the whole world that I could be at the moment than this place. Ah. Give me a sea break. Ooh. Yeah, this has been a really great place to boondock because as you can see now it's the hottest time of the day and we are on the shade and well just by the sea bunkers and more bunkers and more bunkers someone has pooped in here really nice this part of the harbor, military harbor, is still on work, working condition, so there's even a guard on that gate. Working army is really good job. It pays well and the office looks good. I have also a table in my office. And this is the view that I watch eight hours a day. And no one comes there. No one. Day. We are leaving beautiful Montenegro behind and entering Croatia. Over oh, uh, there. There. We also met here a van dwelling couple. Actually, a retired Danish couple who are traveling with the minivan. I wouldn't believe that any Finnish couple who are retired would do that. So, thumbs up for that. And this is Prevlaka Peninsula. Basically, abandoned, again, abandoned military base. Yeah. Huge one. As you can see when we drive here, like there was 13, 30 different kind of buildings. Look, big sparacus. Huge one. These views are not enough for us. We are eager to move. Campings, but don't you think? Thank you, Croatia. And this is the last view that we see before we go sleep. 
I love boondocking. I couldn't go like in the camping ground if you can find these kind of places around the Europe. I cannot go. Good thing about working in an office like this environment that someone brings food to your table when you want to take a break. And no dishes. And no dishes. <laughs> Hello, Olive Tree. No, long time no see. Sabra Jenny Pusenje. Something you are not allowed. Something. Car repair shop. They have this thing going. Nice. I love the abandoned buildings. Yeah. Kind of sad. And we saw a coyote or something, some kind of fox dog thing. This kitchen needs some sanitary cleaning. Yeah. I have to go my 11.30 appointment. So, who are you coming to visit? May I introduce you our headquarters? You have a rather minimalistic office here. Yes. They had maps and in here. Here we have maps. Yes. But now just mouse trap things. Oh, mouse droppings. Lovely cold breeze inside this castle. Let's explore. Yeah. And as you can see, they made huge amount of damage. This is the only best thing you can get out up there. refreshing go yes. to swim there and that's true ah. wash our sweaty asses to the Adriatic sea if the sea gets any warmer it's not that's cold anymore yay pointy ones are back we love these trees and the pointy like, trees yeah like cy cypress something. cypress something Maps me showed us place to get water. Good. This time this way that maps me guides us and we don't add info to maps me. So 
soon we are in Bosnia again and now we have a blue blue waters and muscles and oh our truck is making that hell of a noise doctor yeah. eat our dust bitches because we are in Bosnia still oh. We came to Bosnia again on this little strip. Do we you know what that means? Bosnian chicken! Yes. Cheap chicken! We bought two and a half kilos of chicken. Four euros per kilo. Yeah, filet. Yeah, pretty Not good. Much. Yeah, and we bought one kilo of cheese. Yeah. And the lady was like, one kilo? Yeah. He asked three separate times. No. Are you sure? And when we go to grocery store we have to pack things everything into these containers so they are neatly on the cupboard so we can see we are in Bosnia all the Kyrillic letters are marked over any wind and we came here just to eat lunch on this little town or edge of the town which is approximately there found ourselves a Boondagi place, actually from the same town that we were having lunch. Oh god, it's there, up there. Uh, actually this is walkway on summer time. So it turns to road that you can drive with your car through winter time. Yeah, the place we found it through satellite view. We saw that there's possibility to drive here with a car so we came here walked from the city first and then we saw that there's a place for van to be overnight and we came here awesome 